Hello, everybody. I'm having a little bowl of cereal. Hope you don't mind while I do that. But I, I found this really cool thing. Let's see if I can share the screen. And you can actually, uh, you can partner with a robot. Yes, with artificial intelligence. It's really crazy. Let me find it here. Google Chrome. Okay, yeah, right here. It's this thing called uh, <clears throat> My AI Team. And basically, you go in here and you can tell the artificial intelligence to do stuff for you. And I, I think you've seen some, probably seen some of my images. Here's my AI art. Like I made this little piano. Actually, I don't think I shared that one. But see, I made all these different kind of um, images. Oh, I love these pianos right here. But I made them by, if I click on it, then it tells you what I typed in. I typed in grand piano perched atop Mount Everest with the moon rising in neon futuristic colors. So I'm going to copy that. And anyway, that's what I put in this little prompt right here. So I'm just going to paste that in there like that. And instead of saying grand piano, I'm going to say something like, uh, what can we say? Um, tricycle. Let's see, giant tricycle. Tricycle. Perch atop Mount Everest with the moon rising in neon futuristic colors. Okay, let's do that. Anyway, then you have these different models that you can use. Um, Dolly 2, Mid Journey version four and infinite zoom. So I'm going to choose this mid journey thing because I think that's what I used on this one. And then you click on create image. And what it does is it, it does AI stuff. <laughs> it does AI stuff and it'll eventually, it's going to pop up with a little image here. Let's see. Hopefully you can see it. There we go. Isn't that amazing? So anyway, for people that just need art, you could really use this tool and then check this thing out. Like you have a thing for AI writer for people who just like me, you could have a subject. Okay. You have a subject and you want to talk about it, but you don't, you don't know what the subject is. Mm -hmm. And for people that are like just trying to build their YouTube channels and they're trying to do whatever they want to come up with content. Okay. So we also have this AI writer thing. So you can hear it creates this new document and I'm just going to edit that document. And so there's nothing in there. And then you say, I'm going to make a full blog. And then you can say, what do you want to talk about in your blog, right? So I, I think this could also be used for like, you know how you can't ever find out what the what's the true story, like what's real, what's going on in the country. So you could type in things. And I haven't rehearsed any of this. I just thought I'd make a video, like a post Thanksgiving thing, because I'm so grateful to have found these tools because it's like having like some little genius that you can ask. So I'm just going to ask a question in here on a, on a blog and I'll say, tell me something about, tell me something about how to cook a turkey, <laughs> cook a turkey for 25 guests, uh, include desserts, include desserts. And then after dinner, drink, after dinner, drink. Okay. So anyway, I would just want to, then you click on generate full blog. And then it's going to generate the blog for you, which is crazy, right? So uh, hang on, it's doing its thing. It says doing AI things, please wait. You just got to love that, right? You got to love that. So it's doing AI things. And then here you go. It says, this is appropriate for a website devoted to helping parents with children with special needs. So when it comes to cooking a turkey for a large group, there are a few things you should keep in mind. First, make sure your turkey is big enough. A 12-pound turkey will feed about 10 people. So if you're expecting 20 or more, you'll want a 20-pounder. And on and on it goes for the turkey, preheat the oven, for the stuffing, for the dessert, a pumpkin pie is always a crowd pleaser. So don't you just love this thing? So I can save this and I'm going to save it as uh, how to cook a turkey dinner, how to cook a turkey dinner for 25, I think I put. So I'll just save that. And then if I go back to my little documents, here's all my little documents, you'll see that I have how to cook a turkey dinner for 25. Now I also did 
list of countries that are claimed to be a threat to democracy because I thought, why not, right? I wanted to know. And here was a children's story about how to play piano because I thought that might be fun to teach piano because I was going to go get a job as a preschool teacher, as a music teacher. But they said all the teachers have to wear masks and I didn't really want to wear a mask yet. So I asked them to call me back uh, when they're done with the mask thing. But anyway, you could write a children's story about how to play the piano. I'll just bring that up. It says, learning the piano could be fun and rewarding experience for children of all ages. Blah, blah, blah. Sit up straight, find the right keys, use both hands, and don't forget to practice. Okay. Oh, my God. So here is it's just a cool, this thing is really cool. So also this custom command area where you have uh, people have commuted, the community has created AI commands. So here's a Dr. Seuss rhyming generator. Let's try it. So we go in here and it says, Write me a rhyme about what? This gives me a, a prompt. It says, what would you like me to rhyme about? And so I'm going to say, uh, uh, write me a rhyme about uh, Christmas. Okay, let's see. Test the AI command. When you click on test the AI, AI, AI command, it says, tis the season to be jolly, fa la 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 Entering into the spirit of the holidays with family and friends, we're all filled with good cheer. What fun it is to celebrate this time of year. Okay. Well, then we have, uh, here's one, daily words of affirmation. Let's test that. It says, any specifics? Uh, let's see. How about uh, confidence and courage? So here's the daily words of affirmation. Know that you are capable of facing anything that comes your way. You have the strength and courage to overcome any challenge. Be confident in yourself and believe that you can achieve anything you set your mind to. Surround yourself with positive people and ideas and let go of anything that is holding you back. You are capable of great things. Nice. So I'm just going to take that daily word of, of uh, affirmation daily words of affirmation when I copy it, I did a control C, C or command C on my Mac and then go over here to the A, to the documents and I can create a new document. Well, here's a new document already up that sometimes it just creates one when you go into the window. So I just edit them wherever it says new document. Otherwise I'll make a new one and I'm just going to paste in that daily affirmation and I'm just going to call it affirmation affirmation one so you know i might make like a little short video on instagram or something and i might need a some kind of a inspirational thing to say and so this ai tool could help me create things right and so for anybody who's building things like that that are content creators and just need some ideas to get them going this is a great way to do it um, i especially i haven't really explored all these custom commands here um, but there's a bunch, well, there's 60 of them right now. And also you can create, you can make your own. Uh, I, mean, I don't know how you do that, um, but you'd have to do some research on how to do that. And like, here's a comedy pickup lines. Now let's do, uh, here's Bible verses. Here's AI therapist. Here's a mansplained marketing FAQs. Wow, this is so fun. But you get the idea uh, that this thing is just, I'm sure this is the beginning. Uh, I'm sure there'll be other other places and probably cheaper places that you can do these kinds of things. But um, I would say for anybody who has a, uh, is sit, wants to sit around on the internet and build stuff and promote stuff, these, these tools would be great to help you with whatever. Here's a poem generator. These tools would be great to help you generate content. So let's test the poem generator. Who is this poem for? All the develop your superpower folks. Develop your superpower folks. Okay. And what do you want to say? Uh, I want to say, uh, hang on. You have infinite ability to create anything you desire. Nice. And what else do you want to add? Uh, be bold. Dream big. Don't quit. 
<laughs> okay, so we'll test this AI command and see what it's going to generate me a poem, right? So it's thinking, and then it says, all the develop your superpowers, folks. You have infinite ability to create anything you desire. Be bold, dream big, don't quit. You can have whatever you want in life, but only if you're willing to pay the price. Some will say it's too scary. Others will say it's not worth the risk. But I know that with great power comes great responsibility. So use your powers wisely and never give up on your dreams. I like that. All thanks to AI. So you can sit here and you can create stuff. And that's what I'm doing because I want to start posting a daily video on my YouTube channel. And I was short on content. Like, what do I talk about? Like, so you, you could use this thing this um, my AI team and the tools to generate content for yourself. Uh, things, uh, conversation starters. So I'm just gonna paste that in here. This is my poem, the develop your superpowers poem. Oops. Develop your superpowers poem. Alrighty, so you can save it. And so this, I think, is so nice. And it also has a um, an affiliate program, an affiliate program. So you can sign up for that. And you can see I just started. Uh, I don't even know what you get for the affiliate program. I just want to share it. But it says seven friends have visited us. So you get your own little link up here. And you can share that. Um, and then what else? The calendar. What's the calendar say? Oh, it just gives me a calendar. I guess I could probably add it. Oh, I can add appointments and things. Okay, nice. Let's go back and look at this AI art because it's so good. So let's say we made that bicycle, right? And the prompt was giant tricycle perched atop Mount Everest with the moon rising in neon futuristic colors. Okay. So what else you can do with this image is you can say down here, which shows all your images, you can say, make me some variations. So I want to make like five variations, let's say of that tricycle. So I just clicked on five and uh, and it's going to be doing AI things to make those five uh, variations of this. But isn't that amazing? I mean, you got the neon. This is really a nice photo. So if you want to use that photo in some of your, oh, and here it's, it's made my um, variations. Here's one with the guy on the, sitting on the bike. But if you want to use any of them, I like this first one. You can just download it, and then there it is. You just double-click on it, and there, oh, you can't see this window because I'm not saving it. Uh, I'm not sharing the window. But anyway, this is incredible. I've, I haven't made a lot of art, but I've made some art uh, that I'm going to use. And even if you just made art and you put it on, uh, like you went on... Uh, Amazon uh, pay as you go or whatever it's called, where you take your art and you stick it on a mug and then, uh, you know, or you sell t-shirts with it. But this is a great way. This is all your art. But these are some, these are some great, great, um, great tools. There's other things I think you can do. Oh yeah. I want to go back over to this. Uh, well, I, I actually put in something here on the, uh, I made a document and I prompted um, advantages, I asked them advantages of leveraging artificial intelligence to answer pressing questions. And then it starts you with a topic. So artificial intelligence has the ability to analyze data and recognize patterns faster than humans. It can also identify relationships between pieces of data that a human might not be able to see. This makes AI a powerful tool for answering pressing questions. There are many advantages to using AI to answer pressing questions. One advantage is that AI can process large amounts of data quickly. This means that more data can be analyzed in a shorter period of time. Another advantage is that AI can find patterns that a human might not be able to see. This can lead to a better understanding of the data. Additionally, AI can help to automate repetitive tasks. This can be this can free up time for humans to other to do other tasks. There are some disadvantages to using AI to answer pressing questions. One disadvantage is that AI can sometimes make mistakes. If the data is not of good quality, the AI might make incorrect conclusions. Additionally, AI can be expensive. The hardware and software required to run AI can be costly. 
Overall, there are many advantages to using AI to answer pressing questions. AI can help to process data quickly, find patterns, and automate tasks. While there are some disadvantages, the advantages outweigh the disadvantages. Nice. So let's say that you had done that, right? You, you, you asked that question and then you saved it off into your documents and then you just wanted to expand on that a little bit. Then you could just come in here into this document and, uh, and then just add to it. Uh, for instance, I could say, uh, say more about the advantages of use of leveraging leveraging AI to solve real world problems. Problems. Okay, so I'm just gonna go ahead and generate that. Now this takes a lot less time than it does to generate those short uh, videos, those uh, infinite loops. Uh, so this is just amazing stuff. I mean, this is just, uh, so it already has here, it's added to, my thing, leveraging AI to solve, I'm gonna put a little, I'll put a little space between here. Then you could say, okay, great. And then you get, here's some more information. Today, artificial intelligence is being used more and more to solve real world problems. And it talks about that. You could give this to your writer and say, here, start with this and turn it into something. Or you could also do things like, uh, you can copy this whole thing. I'm gonna copy this com command C. I'm going to copy that whole thing, and I am going to go over here to um, the custom command section. And there was one in here that just said rewrite. I think it had something in here. It says rewrite uh, something. Let's see. Rewrite what you've already written. Here we go. Rewrite to original content. So I'll go ahead and test that. And so uh, it says, what is the article you would like to rewrite? And then I'm just going to just going to copy all that and I'm going to paste in all that information that I just copied okay and test the AI command and see what it comes up with it's basically going to rewrite the content that I had originally written that it had originally written rather okay so I'm going to copy this copy this out and go back over to my documents and we'll go to the one which was advantages of leveraging artificial intelligence to answer pressing questions. Okay. And I had copied, oh, I think I didn't save what I had already copied. Well, maybe I did. Anyway, I think I didn't save it. <laughs> but here's what I rewrote. I'm just going to paste that. Some believe that artificial intelligence could be a powerful tool to help businesses tackle, just fix this, Real world problems. So all of this was written by AI. So is that's my point, is that you can just build stuff uh, very quickly and then come back to it. So this takes care of all your creative stuff and then you can add your expertise to whatever topic or art that you've put in. Like if you were an artist, I imagine an artist would be able to, I'm not an artist, but if you were an artist, I imagine you could take some of these images uh, save them and then bring them into, you know, Photoshop or into whatever your image software is that you use and you can manipulate. Like these things, I wanted to make these pianos. That's why I made so many of them. I want to make a little children's book on uh, maybe for preschoolers on how to learn to play the piano. And I want to illustrate it with these images. So I made them and it's really, really cool. And uh, so that's what I wanted to show you. What else do I have? I think I think I went over every, oh, the companies. I actually created a company and um and then I and then I could have the company uh create me a sales page or something. So I did that. And I'll say so it says we have these free recordings. Uh what did I write in here? I wrote we have these free recordings that are super helpful to your success. Let's see if can back up here. Yeah, that are super helpful to your success. And I decided I was going to make, a, let's say I wanted to make a video script on it. Okay. And so it's working, it's doing its AI thing. And I think it's going to come up with me with a video script that I could use. So I got everything I need. And anyone who needs tools like this, uh, I think you should get something like this. It's not that expensive. You get 25 free credits. 
Um, well, let's see, did it do it? Open, oh, here it is, open company documents. So this is the, this is November 25th, so this is what it created. Let's see what it says. What's up, everybody? We have these free recordings that are super helpful to your success. You're never too old to learn lifelong learning for success. Solving lack of confidence with knowledge and encouragement. English tips for a more successful life. If you're trying to solve lack of confidence, then you need to get my free recordings. I'm extremely talented and knowledgeable on the subject of confidence, and I can help you achieve success. So don't hesitate. Get my recordings now and start living a more successful life. Isn't that cool? And that was under the companies. Uh, when I went to the companies thing, uh, and it created a video script based on some answers I gave when I when I made a new company. So let's say I added a company, and I have another company, um, and I and it's called and I has a different name with a different logo and different quest different answers to the questions. So you, who are your ideal clients? Uh, what are your clients' biggest challenges, and how can your products and services help your ideal client? your brand tone of voice and the main action you want your audience to do after reading. And in my case, uh, for this company here, I wanted the main thing I want them to do is to sign up to get my free recordings. So I could click on, I could click on sales page and I think it'll make me another sales page different than the sales page I already made. So I, I should have two sale pages and see, it shows I have two documents. One of them was a sales page and one of them was a video script. And so after AI is done doing its thing here, then now I have three documents. And that third one's going to be a second sales. So let's see what it says. So here's the here's the newest one. It's the same as this one. This one, the first one I made, do you sometimes feel like you're not good enough? Blah, 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 right? Um, and then the second one, let's go back. Well, I mean, let's go back to the companies and then go to the documents. And so this is the newest one. Let's see if it wrote something different. Oh, it kind of, the, oh, it did write something different. The best 20 to 40 year old, oh, oh, wait. Product sales page, the best 20 to 40 year olds and the retirees who refuse to accept they're done face their biggest struggles. All oh, those are with confidence. They can be helped by these free recordings. They're super helpful to success. The recordings are in English. And then it has, so anyway, I'd have to play around with this and see exactly what to, what to do to make this into a real product sales page. But it's like, you can't beat that. I mean, 20 seconds for it to come back and say, uh, here's nine points, a course on how to be a great employee, a course on how to get a job you love, a course on how to be a successful student, a course on assertiveness training, a course on managing time and priorities, a course on developing positive thinking, a course on overcoming. Those are all suggestions from my, um, from what I put in as answers to my question when I set up this company. So this is marvelous. I mean, this is really, really good. And then I guess I got a little place for contacts for my leads and my book calls and my clients. I can add a lead. But, th but this isn't my primary business. I just think these are great tools and I wanted to share about them. And so you guys all have a great day. I think that's it. So if I put in uh, love and happiness throughout the world. Peace and love. Abundance everywhere. In neon, I kind of like neon. In neon colors, the style of Mad of uh, Peter Max. I think he has two axes. Anyway, let's try it with different uh, models. So here's a stable stable diffusion. We'll create the image. These images don't take very long. And anyway, you just have to play with it. I guess there's probably some place somewhere. I love the piece. Oh my God, it's crazy. So um, that was stable diffusion. And then here's another model called Dolly 2. We'll create an image that way. And let's see how it 
how that one does with the with a different uh, model. Okay, that's nice. And then we got Mid Journey version four. I really like this model, uh, or so far I've I've liked that the most. So let's see what Mid Journey has to do. Do 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 do. Oh, nice. Oh, that's great. And so, like I said, if you, anything that you do like, you can say, make me some variations. I'm going to make 10 of 10 variations of this. I really like that. And let's see what, uh, we'll click on 10. And I think it's going to go ahead and create those things. And this other thing's still creating. Uh, so anyway, and then, oh, the last one was uh, infinite zoom. I think I'll make an infinite zoom of this too. I think that would be nice. All righty. So that's it. That was that was just kind of a little preview of this this tool I found called My AI Team. And you know, I've been working on the mindset stuff. Uh, my retirement project is uh, technology, mindset, and music. So this is a little piece of technology, along with. Uh, kind of artistic musical kind of things that I could see some possibilities with this. I mean, there was a thing over here in the custom commands that you could, you could write yourself a rap song. So let's see, uh, it says Slim Shady Rap Generator. So let's test that. It says, what would you like Marshall Mathers to rap about? Okay, so I say write a rap about Elon Musk taking over the world world with them with a mic drop with mic drop okay so let's test that and on it goes it's gonna write me a little rap a rap generator and I'm not even a rapper it's thinking still thinking 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 oh there we go so here's the sh Slim Shady Rap Generator for write a rap about Elon Musk taking over the world with a mic drop. I'm the richest man alive. I'm taking over the world and I'm doing it with a mic drop. So watch out. I'm coming for you. I'm coming for everyone. I'm taking over the world. There's no stopping me. I'm smarter than everyone. I'm richer than everyone. I'm better than everyone. There's no one like me. I'm taking over the world. There's no stopping me. I'm coming for you. I'm coming for everyone. I'm taking over the world. There's no stopping me. <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay, but you get the idea. I think this. I think this is a very, very good tool to have. And I'll put a link in the description uh, where you can get it. But it's just crazy. I think it's. It's. I think the tool is just really good. So do your research because there's probably other places out there that. That are cheaper, but this one's pretty cool because, like I said, it has the the dot the AI writer. It's got the uh, you can save all your documents. Oh shoot, I should have saved that little rhyme. Let me go back over. I, I don't think it saved my my uh, raps. No, oh. let's go over to custom command and see if it somehow remember my slim shady rap generator. Uh no. It didn't remember. Oh, okay. Well, anyway, okay, that's it. That's all I wanted to show you. This is cool. And I might do like a, I've been doing with my mindset training, I've been doing like a weekly uh, Zoom call that's free uh, for people who buy my course. So I might do like a weekly little tech call where people can mess around with the my, my, my AI team. And we can create stuff. Maybe I can create stuff for you. Maybe you don't want to get the thing. Maybe you don't want to do it, but you but you want to come on the Zoom call and give me some phrases to put in and I'll come up with some art for you and we'll send it to you. Okay? Hey, who knows? Anyway, okay, that's it. I'll see you later. I have to share. See you later, alligators. Oh, here's the end. End the meeting for all.